In this tutorial, I will show you how to update your WordPress manually. First, let's see the automatic way. Logging to your backend of your WordPress and go to the dashboard and under the dashboard you see the updates. Click on updates. If the new update is available, you will see the updates here and then you will see the installs the new versions button. You click that one and then update your WordPress. But if some reason if you couldn't update it automatically, you need to do it manually. So first download the latest version of WordPress. So the latest version is 6.3.1. You download it from the WordPress official web website. WordPress.org And you can see that the new version, the latest version is 6.3.1 and here is current version is 6.3.1. But if your version is different than the latest version, you download it from here first and unzip your download. And then you open your FileZilla, which is the FTP client server. You enter your details here. And this side is your desktop site and this is your server site. Now, which files are you going to transfer to your server? Let's go and check that one. Once you unzip your WordPress, you will get all of these files. And you just need to copy WordPress admin. Transfer WordPress admin all. Leave WordPress content at the moment. Don't do anything. And transfer WordPress includes, which replaced you to the existing files. And from here to here, transfer all of these. And this is your configuration file to your database. So make sure you leave this configuration file on each date. And now let's come back to the contents file. So open your contents folder. The reason I said don't uh, transfer this one at the first place is because this we have some themes, plugins, and uploads which we have. If we transfer this one, this will replace to your exiting site and all your settings will get changed. So I will show you the uploads. Here you can see I have some uploads. When I transfer it, this upload will get replaced to the blank. So I want to get this one. This is my backup file. I'm showing you from the, my backup. So when, when you have the clean websites, I have the here, the, clean, the old version. When you have the clean website, I can show you here. You can see there, there's no uploads. So it will replace to your uploads. But the next thing is you need to transfer the files only. Transfer the index.php, go to each folders and transfer these files. Go each things and transfer the file only. But don't update your uploads. Yeah, that's it. This is how you manually update your WordPress if you couldn't do it automatically. Thank you for watching my video. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share. See you next time. Bye.